Hey guys, it's your favorite Unc here. Go ahead and click that subscribe button below so you don't miss a single episode of Nightcap. That button right here. Come for the sports, stay for the stories. In UFC 300, Max Holloway produced one of the most shocking and most one of the most violent moments in Octagon history. With a mere 10 seconds on the clock, he summons Justin Gaethje. Stand in the pocket. Let's go. And they stand in the pocket. And with one second on the clock, Holloway catches him. Face plant. Holloway. Yeah. Hey, you got to be careful. You got to keep, keep your hands up. UFC president, UFC CEO Dana White called it one of the greatest moments in, in, uh, uh, in the company's history. I get it. I mean, Gaethje felt he was behind. I ain't got nothing to lose. But, but I, I thought, what about strategy? I thought normally when you go to, you got yeah. strategy. When you stand in the pocket, yeah. you ain't got no strategy. Yeah. You just, uh-oh, whoever hits, who first? Who clips who? Yeah, but I mean, it was great for the ending oh. of the round, though. Those last few sec. No, you, you, I mean, listen, he called him to the front. Yeah. Hey, man, let's throw them things. What you trying yeah. to do? But again, when it comes to throwing them things and engaging in the pocket like that, hey, if you let loose, you got to keep you one of them. You got to stay Ocho. on the phone. You got to stay on the phone. You got to let one go nah. and, 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 you do it like and, and bring Ocho. it back home. You do it like this here. You see, ain't nobody got, ain't nobody got nothing up. Oh, yeah. Well, you know, they're tired. They're tired yes. at that point. So what's the first thing that goes away when you're tired? Your technique. Yes. You take all, all that Well, when you away. summon somebody and to the pocket, I'm not you even ain't gonna trying say, to go to... No, we wouldn't call that a lucky punch, would you? Because you know his head was no, down. No, 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 no. 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 Okay, I'm. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. No. I'm just saying. Hey, that was nice. That was that was a great finish. That was a great yeah. ending. A great ending. What you think about what, what you think would happen if, if Max Holloway had to fight me? Man, look here. Boxers don't do well in, in the UFC. That's why. That's why UFC fighters have to go to the boxing ring. Ain't no boxer right. going to do nothing with no guy in the UFC. It's going to be older than matter. So time. I'm. Let me, Okay, let me let me let me ask yeah. you a question now. Let me ask you a question cuz I was state wrestling champ in 82, mm -hmm. okay? You know you see my hands go. I got hands. So at what point do you think Max Holloway would beat me if we were to get in the octagon? Like round 1, 2 or 3? 30 seconds. Wait, what you mean 30 seconds? Tap you out in 30. Why are you why are you I'm putting, all, you I'm putting all my money. I'm taking all the money I got, everything I own, and putting it on Max Holloway. So you think you think you think you think Max Holloway can beat me? Beat the brakes off you and two more people just like you. You know what? Max Holloway, if you see this, if you have any time, if you have any time during your break until your next fight, please let's spar. Let's get some footage. I just want to show Uncle 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 Sharp oh. that I ain't with the bullshit. Please, Ocho. brother Max Holloway. Ocho. Congratulations, but uh, please, Ocho. There's le what to every sport. There's levels, and I and right. I, 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 I know he, you. You he's the, you, he's the, he's you, the best you're of the best. I know. Entry, I know. Good entry level. Good entry level. Entry, entry. but to go to that top entry. Man, oh. <laughs> yes. Man, I thump Max Holloway chin, man. Don't play at me like that, man. I'm out the city, man. What you talking about, man? Uh, I'm built for that. Uh, I mean, you know, you go back to uh, excuse me. Uh, I don't know if you remember when um, uh, Connor caught Jose Aldo. Oh yeah, he clipped him. Uh, yeah. Oh, at the beginning, yeah. at the beginning, at the beginning, when he was coming in, being aggressive. That was a good Mom's counter. Dog flying knee, uh, Ben uh, Aspirin. Uh, Khabib, Maul, mm -hmm. uh, Connor. I mean, yeah. look, there have been some Holly Holmes signature leg kick over Rodney Rousey. Mm -hmm. Uh, mm -hmm. look, it was it, it was a great. Uh, Pierre did a great, did an unbelievable job on Hill. I mean, because Hill yeah. kicked him in the groin, and um, mm. uh, what's the guy? What's the black referee name? Herb Dean. He went to check. He said, "No, nah, I got it. Don't even worry about it. Don't you, don't you worry right, about right, it. Right. Don't Herb." Right. Herb, I got this. I got this. Yeah. Walked it down, clipped it with a left. And then um mm -hmm. uh what's the name? Kyla. Kyla Harrison. Makes her yeah. UFC, made oh, her boy. UFC debut, two-time judo champ, two-time Olympic gold medal in judo. What? Mm -hmm. What? Holly Holmes is an outstanding kickboxer, outstanding boxer. Yeah. What in mm -hmm. the hell would make her stand in the clinch with Kayla Harrison? Maybe she got, maybe because Kayla flipped her 
and Holly mm-hmm. reversed it. So maybe she got a little right. confident, like, oh, I feel it pretty good. <laughs> Are you out your mind? Yeah. I'm, Listen, the hey, only time you, you, Kayla you, you, Harrison you, you, gonna touch me when we go to the side of the ring and we touch them gloves, hey, good luck. That's the only time she touches me. It. Other than that, that's I'm it. kicking a punch. And ain't she's a two-time Olympic gold medal judo. So that right. means she's used to grappling. That's what she she wants mm-hmm. to get to. It's the same thing with Ronda Rousey. Mm-hmm. Ronda Rousey, she was what? Used to getting her hands on people hands and on flipping them and arm barring you. Yeah. And so mm-hmm. what did the Holly Holm do? Kick her upside her head. <laughs> what did the lioness do? Don't, 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 don't say yeah, it like I'm just that. I'm saying. So I know you're, I'm not, <laughs> listen, sometimes, you know, people get, a, I'm going to beat them at their own game. Nah. Ah, nah, nah. See, this notion, to beat a man, you got to beat the man. The hell you say, mm. if somebody else beat the man, I'll beat him. <laughs> damn, damn that beat the man. You got to beat the man. No, hell no. If somebody beat the man on the way, I got to fight the man. Well, I'm going to beat the man yeah. to beat the man. Damn what y'all say. But I, I don't hey, understand that. that. I, didn't, I didn't understand that. I don't know. Listen, every listen. you have a corner. You come into a fight with a plan. Sometimes the plan that you do have, you're not able to execute it. So you go to plan B. I'm not sure what her plan B was. Well, plan B, but it wasn't what it, it it wasn't what it should be because the outcome wasn't what we thought it was going to be, especially for the accolades and what she what her resume looks like so far. Hold on, my my my, my thing going dead. Damn. Yeah. That. Wait, I can hear you. Yeah, we hear you. I'm just I, I don't I don't I don't I don't I don't I don't, I don't get I don't I don't get Holly Holmes' strategy, and uh, I don't think anybody in the yeah. chat get their strategy either. Because you know what Kayla Harrison is. You know what she represents. She's a gold medalist in judo. That means you beating women all over the world and you used to getting your hands on people. I'm not getting in the clinch with you. Hell no. Nah. I'm going to kick. But also, you, you got to think about, you can't, you can't run the whole I'm fight. I'm going to kick. I can kick. The more, the, the more you the more, the more you have to, the more you have to move around, the more you kicking, the more tired you That's get. That's okay. I... So you got you got to be you got to be very strategic but, as, as well. Here's the thing: it's the same thing in, in boxing. What you got to do? You box. You keep people. Somebody that's used to fighting in the pocket, fighting inside. Right. Why would I? Why would I? Yeah. Why would I get inside? Right. Why would I get into the pocket with Mike Tyson, knowing that's yeah. what he whoa, wants whoa, to be? Whoa, whoa. Hold on, hold on now. Now we got Jake Paul getting ready to fight Mike yeah. Tyson coming up in July, or June, whatever. What does Mike Tyson fight in all the fights that he's had? He's slipping up under yeah. everything, trying to yeah. get where on yes. the inside. Yes. So you can't you can't run the whole no. fight because what Mike is going to do, he if if you if you're a great boxer and know how to cut off the ring, boy, it'd be hell. When, when it, it's going to be when hell. When he fought Lennox Lewis, what did Lennox Lewis do? Keep that jab, jab, jab keep out that there. jab up. Keep the, that jab, keep that jab in his face to keep him up off. And now one of the guys, the only guy that really fought him in the pocket and beat him was Holyfield. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, them, them boy was throwing even, that when leather, he, boy. even when he went to uh, uh, when he went in Japan and he ended up losing for the first mm-hmm. time to uh, right. Uh, what's the guy's name? Who did he look? Uh, what's the guy? He uh, the greatest upset in boxing yet. Yeah, I can't think of the guy's name. Kept that jab on him. Kept that jab on mm-hmm. him. Boom, boom. That jab. Yep. Boom, boom. Just kept pounding mm-hmm. him. Jab over right. Jab overhead yeah. right. And then mm-hmm. you saw Tyson looking for his mouthpiece. Yeah. Buster Douglas. Buster Douglas. Oh, yeah. yeah when Buster, Buster Douglas beat him down and, and, and what you call it? What did he do? Because everybody had made the mistake of fighting him in the pocket. Or he, he'd walk yeah. him down. He'd get close. Walk he would take a couple of punches just to get off that. Mm-hmm. Get one. And when you feel that one, shh. And, it, and you know Mike Tyson, his signature is a double punch. Mm, the boot, that, the uppercut. He's coming the to the body. Cut. Yeah. Coming up. Mm-hmm. You know it's coming. But that, that left that left hook man and that uppercut was some nasty. Yes, yes. nasty. So, nah, Holly Holmes made a mistake of, of fight like that, and then she ended up. Uh, 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 Kayla ended up mounting her, getting her from behind, rear naked choke, tapped her. That was it. Mm-hmm. Al Jermaine Sterling, yeah. hey, you- his fight, he won, but it wasn't interesting. Uh, I don't think Dana mm-hmm. could be is is pleased with that. I understand that he moved up, but. His his fight wasn't wasn't interesting. Piera right. was great. I mean, they had some. Uh, I mean, all the fights were were really good, but 
Man. Ooh. Max Holloway. Hey, before you Yeah. Hey, back back to back this thing on Max again, man. I know Max is probably gonna see this and and I, I really wanna like get your honest opinion on what you just said earlier when we talk about Max Holloway, yeah. right? And if if him and I were to get in the octagon, you re, you really disrespecting me at thinking I'm I'm gonna get tapped out in yep. thirty seconds. I you know think so? so. That's a different animal. Like no, I like like you know me. You mm-hmm. know my competitive mm-hmm. edge, my competitive nature, my willing to try and do anything. You know, as a as a grown man, like think about this. Let's say my kids are standing behind me, right? Wait, just let me finish. Let's say my kids are standing behind me. And Max Holloway got to get through me to get to my kids. What you think finna happen? Leave your kids at home. <laughs> <laughs> Make it dip. <laughs> so, <laughs> make it difficult for him to get them. <laughs> Man. <laughs> That's what you should do. That's exactly what you should do. Don't do that. Don't do that, Ocho. Hey. And if you watch, Ocho, I mean, I'm a, like when I like when I watch when I watch fights, Ocho, I'm looking at <laughs> that, hey, that's fucked up. <laughs> Ocho, when I'm watching fights, I'm looking at like yeah. when they come down because I know, yeah. Uh, and so I'm looking at Holly Holm and I'm looking at Kayla Harris, H- Harrison, mm-hmm. and I'm looking at her, mm-hmm. and. Women and fifth don't become a no bull giant. Right. That's a large woman. Once she refueled, yeah. Yeah. she made weight at 135. She's walking around yes, at 170, 175. Easy. Because when she refueled, she looked like she was like yeah. 155, 160. And that's in 24 mm-hmm. hours. So I know yes, she's sir. she's a law, she's a woman that's walking around 175. Mm-hmm. Easy. Yeah. Easy. Yeah, cause man, poo, I mean, if you yeah. if you yeah, look you at just... the steals of her when she was like, man, I mean, she got cap. She's a uh, same thing with Pieta. I mean, he refueled and gained like twenty five pounds, which lets me mm-hmm. know that he's a large man. He's a big light heavyweight, big dude. Yes, yeah. that mm-hmm. tells you that. With see the thing that made Floyd so great, besides of his skill. Floyd is not a naturally not a naturally large man. Floyd probably no. only losing five to six pounds to make weight at no, one forty seven. Every, t- every, every time, or he yep. might not have to do anything different anything. to make one fifty four. Mm-hmm. Right. Where everybody else is is having to come down, down substantially. Yeah, Floyd is is Floyd. Now he's immensely skilled, yeah. so I don't want people to say, "Well, the only reason." No, I'm yeah. not saying that. But I'm saying yeah. someone that doesn't have to lose that much weight to come down, right? He's gonna be able to fight his natural strength. He's gonna be, and I felt that that was one of the advantages that Floyd had because if you ever been around Floyd, he's not a mm-hmm. a guy that walks around at one sixty, one sixty five, mm-hmm. dropping down to yeah. one fifty four to one forty seven. Floyd might weigh one fifty five, maybe, mm-hmm. maybe I don't know. He probably never yeah. touched one sixty. <laughs> if, you, if you see him, if you, if you see him, he looked like he about at one forty seven yes! or one fifty for that battle. But again, once he gets in that ring, the skill oh, yeah. in the pocket, out the pocket, from distance. I mean, his ring IQ is like Damn no other. Road. And whatever, whatever, whatever you doing, he has something to combat that each and every round, and he will pick you apart. He just a computer. He will, he will, he will pick your ass apart. All he apart. doing is just gathering information. Oh, you doing this? Oh, information, round by round. And then, uh, hey, he pulled, oh, he loved, his favorite is that pull mm-hmm. point. Mm-hmm. Bam! Yeah. <laughs> hey, hold on, and leave, he'll leave his head out there, leave uh, his head out there on purpose, waiting on, waiting on you to, to throw something. Pop! Ah, man. I'm kind of, I'm kind of mad about this, Mac, this Max Holloway stuff, man, about you, man. Pop! And come back with it, yeah. Yeah, it yeah. was like, like I said. I, I wanted to see. I wanted to see uh, 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 Amanda Nunez. I think she wants Amanda Nunez, but Amanda Nunez is smart enough to know not to let her, get, not to let her grab her. So Amanda Nunez right. is gonna be looking to you know, because that's a, because. But yeah, no, she retired. But she, 
Dana, how much money you got to bring Amanda Nunez, the lion inside yeah, of retirement? I, I, I come out. She, 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 hey, the, for the right for the right amount of money, anybody come out of retirement and, now? Because you got to know, hey, this is what she's good at. I'm not letting you grab me. I'm not. I'm not mm-hmm. letting you grab me. I'm ready to see. I want bones. I want John Jones to get healthy because I want to see him fight. I like to see him fight, uh, uh, fight Francis and Ganu. I always now John Jones, in my estimation, is the greatest. He's the most complete boxer there is because he can do it all. Heavyweight, nah. Yeah. As far as MMA, he's the he's the greatest MMA fighter. Well, MMA, that's what that's yeah. what I meant. Well, I mean, John Jones is he fights that heavyweight. He's though, a right? heavyweight now. Nah, he moved up. He was a light heavy. He took the belt from uh, okay, he took okay. the belt from Syria Don. I think he took the belt from Syria Don. I think, yeah, because uh, uh, really, uh, really Ngannou had to vacate it. Syria Don ended up winning. And he mm-hmm. took it from him. So, right. I like that. Yeah, hey. but I would, I would, I would, hey, lo- I would somebody- love that. That's gonna be. Because he's made mince meat at everybody at what light heavy. He beat uh mm-hmm. he beat Gone and he beat uh the guy out of uh Stipe. He didn't he beat Stipe, didn't he beat yeah. Stipe, Stipe uh Miosic? No, uh John. Or did he just fight just he did he just take the belt from uh John John? I mean uh Cyril Gone. Did he fight Stipe? No, and Gano. Cause he can, I mean, he can wrestle, he can submit you. Mm-hmm. I mean, he can, he, he can box. Yeah, striker. man. I mean, I mean, striker. and he's another. He's a big light heavy. Mm-hmm. So him, him, he's not gonna have to lose any weight because you can go up. I think up to two sixty five to be a heavyweight. Right. So he's not gonna have to do anything. Uh, he, I, I, I think that's the. But right now, uh, um, and is in a different league. I think he's what, yeah, right for us a PFL. Yeah. So, and contractually, it could never happen anyway because he's with another league, huh? Okay. Yeah, John. Because he uh, uh he tore his pet. Take. Yeah. He, yeah. He was he was supposed he was scheduled to fight the uh Miocic, and ended up having to pull out because he tore his pet, and he's on the road to recovery. So I don't know who he's gonna fight wow. when it's uh, and I don't know how much longer he wants to fight, but he's right. taking on all comers at the light heavy. Has the belt. It's not very many guys that can say they're a two-time, a uh, two-division champ, but John Jones did that. 